Just one remaining concern, my age. Some people would talk about how old Ginny May is. How much of an issue is that? Like, so oh, a geriatric um, pregnancy is horrible term. Isn't it? Oh, that's what I am. It is a horrible term. term. It yeah. is a horrible term. And women are older having babies. That's a reality. Um, you're fit, you're healthy, you've got no medical problems that we're really concerned about. So that's really good. And I think we just have to kind of go with how you are at each visit and take it as we get it. Mm. All right, and go with the flow. Don't want to put you in a box. Mm. Don't want to make you sort of feel, you know, older mother. Older mother. Yeah. That's, you know, it, it is what it is, mm. and we work with it. And you know, f a healthy lifestyle, healthy living is about where it's at. Memo mahara kitena one step at a time. <laughs> so what is the next step for Jenny May? So the next step is the anatomy scans, which you've got booked in. Yeah. And uh, so we look at that and just make sure we tick all those boxes that we're looking for, for making sure that babies are all okay. Because that's always the thing with twins, I guess, is making sure that one's not growing, getting more than the other, just making sure that they're growing. Yes. Eru and Aye. So there's two placentas. Yeah. Is that always the case? No, it's not always the case. So, Jenny May, you've got um, two babies, two self contained units, if you like, and we want to make sure that they're both growing and got equal distribution of, of growth and well being. Uh, um, yeah, I really do want to find out what they are. Mm. So do the girls, my husband's, um, our two girls. Yeah. They want to know if they're having brothers, sisters, a brother or a sister. Mm. But whatever they are, I'll, I'll send you a photo if you want Aww. me to. Thank you. I'll <laughs> cry again. <laughs> this will be a mess. Thank you so much for letting us oh. come in too. No, you're welcome. So time now for the anatomy scan. Dean and I can't wait to find out if we're having a boy and a girl combo or a tag team of all boys or all girls. Okay, Jenny and Dean, we've got the two babies here, and I can see the membrane in between the two pregnancy sacs there. So if I come to baby on your left, this baby's got its head down. <laughs> baby's heart beating beautifully there, nice and fast. We can see its head, its heart beating. The stomach filled with fluid in the bottom here. And shall I tell you the sex of this baby? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so the baby on your left is a little boy. <laughs> and then if I come across to the other baby, this baby here is baby number two. This is our quiet one. And this one's lying across at the bottom, so it's kind of hiding under your pelvic bone, so that's probably why you're not feeling it as much. Here's baby's head just tucked right down in your pelvis. Baby's heart beating beautifully again, nice and fast. We can see baby's bladder, baby's stomach there. And if we look at the sex of this baby, This baby is also another little boy with little boy bits in between the legs. <laughs> so you are having twin boys. <laughs> They're both in their own separate sacks, and there's a one in three chance of them being identical, and a two in a three chance of them being non-identical. <laughs> 